In 1909, the Phoenix Gazette published a story about Egyptian and Oriental artifacts being discovered in the Grand Canyon by an explorer named G.E. Kincaid. The report details Egyptian hieroglyphs inside a human-carved cave city that was estimated to house up to 50,000 people. They also allegedly found copper tools and a statue of a Buddha-like figure holding two lotus flowers. This story dead ends there, and the 1909 article appears to be the sole origin story of the now famous internet legend. The majority of the Grand Canyon is off limits to the public, which has fueled the fire of a conspiracy to hide lost history. It is very curious though when you consider the cocaine mummies that were discovered in Egypt. In the 1970s, German scientists were studying the hallucinogenic religious practices of Egyptian royals when they were shocked to discover traces of cocaine and nicotine, two substances that are really only derived in high levels from plants in the Americas. Some of the Native American petroglyphs found around the southwest have some interesting similarities to Egyptian iconography. The Rochester panel in Utah has many funerary themes that appear to resemble Egyptian funerary customs. Egyptian artifacts in the Grand Canyon or nah? Let me know in the comments.